Around Las Sports is brought to you by Molson Canadian, made from Canada. Hi, everybody. Welcome back to the show. Mike Lonsborough along with Grant Pollock. And uh, I know it's been a week since we talked about Jerome McGinley getting traded, but let's not go there. Let's just talk about this, Grant, because there are a lot of people that are interested to see how Jerome McGinley adjusts to Bob Hartley's system and playing under a coach that will let him spread his wings somewhat a little more offensively. It's no secret that Jerome McGinley and Brent Sutter butted heads. They didn't like each other. Even though they said in public, oh yeah, everything's good. They didn't like each other and he wasn't keen on his system. So, having said that, how much can we expect from Jerome under the new system? I think with this new coaching staff, Jacques Cloutier, Martin Gelina, Bob Harley together, much more upbeat than in past regimes and, patch, and past environments with the coaching staff. So the answer is I think Jerome will be more positive, happier and respond better with this coaching staff. My only concern, Mike, is that we've said this with Ginla before. He had Brian Sutter before, then he went with Greg Gilbert, then he went with uh, Daryl Sutter, then he had Jim Playfair. Got to look after Jerome. How's Jerome? Let's mold Jerome. It's always <laughs> about Jerome. And I asked, I posed that question to Daryl Sutter a few years ago about, you know, are you making the right environment uh, decisions to help Jerome? He said, good question, but let me ask you this question. What's Jerome doing to make the environment better around him? Should he not be helping others around him? Should he not be more of an influence as opposed to what is everybody doing to help me? Why? Am I not helping others? So what are you trying to say? Because when you look at Jerome, and anytime I've talked to him, it's always been this happy-go-lucky guy, friendly, approachable guy. What's the real story with him as far as leadership goes on this team? Well, I don't think he's a true leader. I think Jerome is a good guy, as you say. I think Jerome is a great number two guy. I think that's proven. But he's had his best when he's had like Dave Gagne in the early years, when Craig Conroy was with him, sort of his the guy just before him, so, so Jerome can just do his thing behind. So uh, who knows what Jerome is really all about? He is the huge leader of this team, or his, his image is or so perception, power, yes. perception, so yeah. powerful. But Mike, I just don't know if he is that guy that's leading the troops over the hill, the kind of leader you want. And I think that's what Daryl Sutter was kind of alluding to by saying, why are we trying to find things to help Jerome? Is Jerome doing enough? to help others around the team. All good teams have leaders like that. And I don't know if Jerome is doing that. So to answer your question, yes, Jerome should be happier under this coaching staff. But I've, I've heard this story before with other staff. But you know what, Grant? I mean, the thing is too, uh, this team could survive without Jerome. They couldn't survive without Kiprasov. Mm -hmm. I mean, this would be the worst team in the NHL without Kiprasov. Would they be that team without Jerome? On the ice, no. Yeah. But as a franchise, it's he is we use this word a lot now the brand the, yeah the face of sure. yeah I mean, yeah yeah when you sell season tickets you want recognition people don't recognize chris butler or even joe jay bowmeister is not going to go into a season ticket group and be well recognized and well received but jerome mcginla is truly the face the ambassador for the team and he is the guy so so from a from a franchise standpoint point yes he's valuable but on the ice, no, to me, he's expendable. We've talked a lot about that. You should get a sponsor for Outlaw TV Sports and, and, <laughs> and say, this week, on the Jerome on Report. On the Jerome McGinley Report, <laughs> we could have our latest update. Call us. Call me. Call me. <laughs>